Hello everyone, uh, this is This is Live again, and I just want to talk about this post here. It's Justin Isaac. It's regarding Justin Isaac, and who is Justin Isaac? Um, Justin Isaac is a so-called educated, delight and trained lawyer. Who had made a physical attack with his speech to Honorable Don Pompole, together with Honorable Prime Minister Honorable James Marape, to, during the handover ceremony event hosted by Alfred Manas at Candep Station today. It reads, let us continue. I must read now. I must admit now, sorry, I must admit now with his speech. He is completely away from political speech, he's not even here to dirty politics, speech, political speech, but totally made a physical attack and defaming of character to Honorable Don Pompoli and a Prime Minister Honorable James Marabe today with his speech in order today. On his speech, he said that Honorable Don Pompoli is a fraudster. Cult leader, womanizer, many more annoying words to Honorable Don Pompoli during the event and had put the huge slap on the face of Kanda people to Honorable Don Pompoli. Kanda people were really disappointed and annoyed when Justin Isaac stressed, okay, stressed that Honorable Don Pompoli had killed certain people of Kanda to get their wives as his. He further accused him of marrying too many wives in the expense of Kanda's people. Condep's money and many more. He appeared with his intimating speech as Polly killed one of his brother or idea along that line. Okay, first of all, like if you have like information regarding such expense, Condep's people money. <coughs> and um here you said um Don Pompole is a fraudster, cult leader, womanizer and many more. And by accusing him of the expense of the Kandev's people money, Kandev's money, you have the facts and figures. If you have facts and figures, there are authorities in place, legal authorities in place where you can formally launch a complaint there. We have Ombudsman Commission. People that you need to see for them to question or interview, don't bump all that. As a lawyer, you know what the law is. As a trained, a light lawyer, you know what law is. So it's simple. Rather than talking about someone, someone's personal lifestyle is is too low for you to come down. That law is too low. It's better you go to Ombudsman Commission at least you. Rather than defaming someone, you have to. Just put your facts and figures there for them to question Honorable Don Pompolier for misusing people's funds or marrying too many wives in the expense of kind of money. Yeah, such things you have to bring it to the Ombudsman Commission in like for them to question Don Pompolier, Paulus X as minister for Candep. For 15 years, you have to bring such complaints to the right people so yeah let's continue someone says those are dirty politics with his comment but those are not so as he suggested he justin isaac had made direct physical attack in the speech in the speech to honorable don pompale which everyone present during the event witnessed today while the media stream streaming progressed and this is too much this is too personal and he, Justin Isaac, needs to lodge them with appropriate authority so that information appeared important to him shall also reach everyone like he did today. Yeah, that's true. I haven't seen him saying such words someday, but today he defamed Honorable Don Pompole to the best of his ability, which Honorable Don Pompole needs to challenge his arrest in words first personally. Yeah, that's true. He needs to go to court. <coughs> 2 p.m. Honorable James Marape with this speech as marked defaming of character. He as Justin Isaac criticized that Prime Minister Honorable James Marape is incapable to occupy in the highest office of this land without any without even a particular point behind. Okay, this is childish. This is childish. If you accuse Someone like he merely criticizes these two ca capable leader with integrity and reputation. Good, 
and Propa with the best of his ability, like he haven't made any point all at all during. If you first of all, if you touch, uh, talk about James Marape, James Marape is not a candidate. James Marape is, uh, is from Tari, and he's the prime minister of this state, sovereign state. Is the prime minister of our country. And what personal reason you have, like, why do you talk about prime minister? He's not from Kandahar, and I don't know why this Justin Isaac, I don't know what prime minister did to him. Prime minister is not a Kandahar, is a Tari, and he's the prime minister of this country. And for you to talk about Prime Minister James Marape, then you have to have facts and figures. Bring them up to the people in, like, people in authorities. Ombudsman Commission, that's one of the, that's one of the people, like, that's one of the places where you can put him, complain, blue and all, and question him. Don Pompole, I mean, as a Kandaban, you have to talk about Kandab issue. And Don Popole is one of the Kandep. And talking about Kandep, uh, talking about Don Popole is more good than talking about someone who is not from Kandep. So, like, technically, Honorable Don, uh, Honorable James Marape, the Prime Minister of this country, is not from Kandep, and you don't have to talk about him. You have to talk about, if you want to talk about Don Popole, well, that's good, but you have to have facts and figures in place. And bring those facts and figures to the right people, people in authority, Ombudsman Commission. Launch a formal, formal complaint there. Have him question. Have Honorable Don Pompola question. What has he been doing? He's been misusing people's money. Or, or what has he been doing? Like, you have to have facts and figures rather than defaming someone on social media or public speech with no substance, no proof. That is just too low for an educated trained lawyer to come down is too low. So I would just suggest though, I would like things to go this way. It's like you should lodge a formal complaint with the Ombudsman Commission like we have with um, Lacken Leper 2. Lacken who had a uh, of lodge a complaint with the Ombudsman Commission to have Peter Ibras questioned for the mismanager, mismanagement or mismanaging of the Pogara gold mine money. So, yeah, you have to do something like that as a lawyer. You know the law. You know what the law is. So you have to do what is right, what is legal. Defaming someone is just too low to come down that low. It's too low. It person with such profession coming down to that level to talk about someone's personal life is just too low. So it's better you lodge a complaint with the Ombudsman Commission to have Don Pompola questioned for if he actually used people's money expense to marry too many wives. Is it like real? You have to provide, provide facts and figures, have him questioned in, like with the Ombudsman Commission. So that's what you need to do rather than defaming someone so yeah that's that so i hope this video makes sense thank you for watching subscribe to my youtube channel i'll post more talk about more not just contact issue but uh, the issues around the country i will talk about it so thank you for watching i hope you guys have a good day so take care bye